Justin Trudeau's wife has tested positive for novel coronavirus, his office said late Thursday, while assuring the public the Canadian Prime Minister is fine. Canada's leader and his 44-year-old wife announced Thursday they were self-isolating while she was tested for coronavirus after a public event. Sophie Gregoire Trudeau was tested for COVID-19 today. The test came back positive, the Prime Minister's office said in a statement, adding she would remain in isolation and her symptoms were mild. The Prime Minister is in good health with no symptoms, the statement said, noting he would also be in isolation for two weeks and, on the advice of his doctors, will not be tested for the virus. Justin Trudeau tweeted saying, I have some additional news to share this evening. Unfortunately, the results of Sophie's COVID-19 test are positive. Therefore, she will be in quarantine for the time being. Her symptoms remain mild and she is taking care of herself and following the advice of our doctor. It follows several provinces in Canada, which so far has reported nearly 150 cases in six states, and one death, unveiling stricter measures to combat the spread of the virus while sporting events and entertainment galas were cancelled. The PM would continue his duties, his office said, and would address the country on Saturday. Trudeau, 48, held several meetings over the phone on Thursday, including with the Special Cabinet Committee on COVID-19, his office said, and also spoke with the leaders of Italy, the US and Britain. On Friday he will talk with Indigenous leaders, as well as provincial and territorial premiers to coordinate Canada's response to the virus, and limit the economic impact on the country. After experiencing some mild symptoms following her return from the UK, according to an earlier statement, Gregoire Trudeau immediately sought medical advice and testing. Although I'm experiencing uncomfortable symptoms of the virus, I will be back on my feet soon, she said in a message via the PM's office. Being in quarantine at home is nothing compared to other Canadian families who might be going through this and for those facing more serious health concerns. Since the novel coronavirus first emerged in late December 2019, more than 130,000 cases have been recorded in 116 countries and territories, killing at least 4,900 people, according to an AFP tally. Most of Canada's cases have been traced to China, Iran, Italy or Egypt, but seven people who recently returned from the US also tested positive, public health authorities said. Thanks for watching for more news subscribe like and share world news channel